you know, since I've been recording these videos out here in the park, uh, kind of brought up a topic I thought I'd share a few thoughts on and also ask a question out there to all the other filmmakers and, you know, creative people watching this, uh, watching this video. And that is, uh, you know, where do you go for creative inspiration? You know, for me, being outdoors is really, I, I, I find it to be the greatest thing for sort of getting the creative juices flowing. You know, I love spending time outdoors in nature, uh, even if it's just coming out here to the park. Uh, you know, I find this is, it's just great to, you know, to get out of the house, get away from the computers, the screens, the TV, all of it. You know, it just sort of helps to tune out the noise, clear your mind, and uh, I think it helps with concentration and focus as well. Uh, you know, I love being outdoors. I try to walk about, you know, two or, two or three miles a day, out, you know, outdoors um, every day. And for me, as I said, it really helps me uh, kind of get away from all the noise and the distractions that I think can really uh, impede the creative process. And for filmmakers, I think it's especially challenging because we work with all this technology as uh, part of what we do. You know, whether you're, you know, even talking about things like the cameras, but also, you know, especially uh, editing in front of a computer or watching, you know, films on TV or whatever, you know, we're, we're kind of surrounded by this equipment all the time, I think, or a lot of the time anyway. And uh, especially if you have a job that keeps you in front of a computer most of the day, you know, that's additional screen time that you, that you're dealing with. And I just find that getting away from all of it, uh, you know, even if it's just for an hour or two a day, you know, just to get out for a walk or just to come, come out here into the park. Um, you know, I find that it's uh, kind of when I can do my best thinking. And so I was just curious, you know, for people out there who are involved in the arts, the creative pursuits, filmmaking in any way. I was just kind of curious, what, you know, where do you go uh, when you are looking to get inspired? You know, where do you go for inspiration? Where do you go to sort of clear your mind from all the daily noise and distractions and concentrate or um, you know, just go to uh, you know, think about solutions to creative challenges that you're, you're facing? How do, you, how do you deal with that? How do you deal with that process? How do you deal with those challenges? You know, it's, it's funny sitting out here, just listening to all the different sounds you hear when I'm not talking. I'm reminded of something, uh, I think it was back when I was in middle school, I was in a music class. And as an exercise, the teacher had us, uh, had all of us be completely silent, you know, not say a word, not, not move, not make any noises and asked us what we heard. And of course, a lot of people say, well, nothing. And he said, but you know, listen carefully, what do you really hear? And you hear you know, people talking in the background, you hear chairs screeching in the, uh, across the floor in the classroom above you, you hear uh, sounds of you know, footsteps of people walking in the hallway, um, you know, maybe the sound of the air conditioning system, things like that. And, and what you quickly realize, of course, and the point of the exercise was just how much noise uh, that there is in our day-to-day -day life, even in the you know, supposedly quiet moments. And I think in a lot of cases that can add to the sense of uh, distraction or anxiety that, that we might feel, whether it's the sounds of you know, traffic, um, you know, sirens, uh, you know, TVs and radios on in the background, you know, whatever, where anything that's kind of uh, keeping us from having, you know, a real moment of silence. But I also find it can be really relaxing, you know, and very uh, almost therapeutic in a way when you come out here in, in a place like the park and you just, you can hear, you know, all these different sounds uh, of, you know, whether it's the rustling of leaves, you know, a squirrel, uh, you know, ch chasing a nut, um, you know, the, just 
the breeze moving through the branches. I mean, all these things. And I, I find all these sounds um, inspiring in their own way because I think it just reminds reminds me of how much is always happening. You know, even even if I'm just sitting here, not saying a word, and uh, just kind of taking it all in, there's still all of these things. Uh, all of these little things happening. Anyway, I just thought I'd put the question out there. I'd be curious to hear, you know, if you, you find yourself going out outdoors, spending some time in nature to get creative ideas, do you find that you think better outdoors? Do you think, uh, do you find that it helps to step away from all those screens and all those distractions after a while? just be curious to hear where you go for your creative inspiration. Anyway, thanks for watching and I'll talk to you later.